Moral leadership has always been about making the choices that enhance human life. However, I would argue that today, more than ever, these choices are particularly urgent. If the world reduces its military spending by one quarter, we would buy 1.9 billion computers from one laptop per child. That means that not just every child in Costa Rica, not just every child in Latin America, but every child in the developing world would walk into her classroom tomorrow and find her own laptop waiting for her. With the smallest percentages changes, most of us would never even feel we could equip all homes with electricity, achieve universal literacy, and eradicate all preventable diseases. These are the dividends of peace. That is what we could gain if we put an end to our Russian roulette of military spending. Our countries would then never, never be the same. I have been invited to many, many universities in this country. I think you are all very privileged, uh, the students of the PAW, because, well, this is a marvelous university. And I do admire uh, this great nation because uh, certainly you have the best universities in, in, in the world. When I was at your age, I decided to go to England and <clears throat> get my PhD in political science there. But the education I got is not as good as the one you are getting here. And this is precisely why I, I sent my two children to American universities. My son went to Harvard and my daughter went to BC in Boston. So I do want to congratulate you for for being students here at the poll. Congratulations and good luck to all of you. Thank you.